In 2000, the U.S. government established the Comprehensive Everglades Restoration Plan to remove barriers and bring back its natural flow. The Comprehensive Everglades Restoration Plan involves 68 different projects across South Florida. It's a very complex project, but the benefits are worth it because we need enough fresh water coming south to maintain the biodiversity and the other functions that the Everglades provide us. It protects us from hurricanes and storms. It helps us with flooding, and it provides drinking water for 9 million South Floridians. Just south of Lake Okeechobee, the crown jewel of the restoration plan is taking shape in the Everglades Agricultural Area, or EAA, led by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. Expected to be completed by 2034, this reservoir will work in conjunction with stormwater treatment areas, or STAs, that filter out excess agricultural runoff, like phosphorus, which can lead to harmful algae blooms and negatively impact wildlife. While restoration is in various stages, and there may be decades to go before total completion, Natalie says they're already seeing the positive effects of their work. There's ongoing scientific investigation to understand truly the impacts that more fresh water has on the system. So scientists are already reporting countless more birds and other organisms compared to years past.